ETR reaction gone. Enemy destroyed. ETR reaction gone. Enemy destroyed. Oh, okay. Now we have a direction. <laughs> Did somebody just fart? No, like... Can you repeat what you just said? Yeah, I thought I heard something too. <laughs> what? Obtained Metatron. You, you said direction, right? Uh, where is this going? Where... where... <laughs> It sounded like direction. Yeah. I meant direction with a D. Did I cut I out mean, on Discord or something? Oh, Discord, I'm sure Discord you meant probably. direction with a D. Wow, Discord, you're a prick. Wow. <laughs> like, what? Perfect timing for Discord audio to glitch, leaving out the D. <laughs> well, the thing is. I don't know if any of you heard that. I, appa I, I <laughs> apparently the chat has the chat has also heard it like that. I did yeah, not yeah. mean that. <laughs> what doesn't fucking help is Jaoti's design. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh my gosh. Yeah, because the fucking the pilot seat is right on the mech's crotch. And granted, like in Wait, like the normal robot mode. Are you serious? I thought it was on the helmet. Nope. The pilot seat is on the crotch of the robot. I'm dead serious. I can't <laughs> even I, I... <laughs> Yeah, they <laughs> yeah, solar <laughs> Call that a cockpit. <laughs> Whoa, who thought? Who thought that was a bright idea? I apparently, apparently Kojima did. <laughs> at the very least, put it on a torso, not on the crop. Why? Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I. Oh, bad. This conversation went places. Ah, uh, yeah, Solar Wretches Kojima. Kojima thought it was a good idea. I can't even. Kojima, I respect you for Metal Gear Solid, but what the actual fucking shit is wrong with you? Turn around. Is there uh, anybody else? I... Oh. Obtained Metatron. From that point on, Golden couldn't look at the game the same way again. No, I, I, I literally can't. Enemy destroyed. Oh. Got lost finding the cockpit. Call that a mister. Sully, you motherfucker. Anyway. Raptor destroyed. Enemy destroyed. <laughs> Raptor destroyed. Enemy destroyed. ETR reaction gone. You could say it's the next Erechtheon without deep throating my mic. <laughs> Chucky, I don't know if you remember that. I was playing a game of uh, Mario was missing. Okay. And one of the uh, one of the architects the textures in one of our countries is called the Erechtheon, but I mispronounced that as Erechtheon. <laughs> I think it was it had to be Greece. Uh... Yeah, yeah, I I believe it. <laughs> wow. 
Moving in. There we go. ETR reaction gone. Damage level exceeding 50%. Enemy destroyed. Raptor destroyed. Come on. Get over here. Shit. Yeah, I saw, saw, saw something today that was another reminder of, like, we're getting old. Um, I don't know if you remember, like, the first Digimon, like, animated show that they did Digimon back in, like, the I late kinda, 90s. I, I chose to miss out on that because I was more into Pokemon, and there was a bit of an ongoing debate of which one you prefer. Mm hmm and Yeah. Fair. Um, apparently... They are, so they're celebrating that show's 25th anniversary. Uh, and the main thing that, that caught my attention to this was I saw, saw like a random thing on my timeline. In Japan, they're taking pre-orders on a 25th anniversary Digivice. Like an actual yeah. like digital thing you can get and they like, it has a color LCD screen on it. It's like crazy looking. It's like wow. They... I I. Yeah, you'd be crazy with like they're still coming out with new Tamagotchis and shit nowadays. Oh, so I guess I had to destroy that. Yeah, you can you can buy one of those today. Like you can even buy like the the freaking the Digimon like original. Kind of looking thing. Like, yeah, oh, oh, hello. Party? By forming a party, the enemies reinforce their fighting ability using formations and coordinated actions. It is dangerous for you to let them form a party. Before they do so, I suggest destroying the commander type. I will point out the commander type with this icon. Roger. Sounds tough. Ow. Damage more by hitting it against the side wall. Raptor destroyed. Yeah, that's right. Pokemon Horizons, the the new current anime is is on Netflix. Um Ouch. Destroy. We obtained the device driver of the sub weapon Phalanx. Okay. This weapon produces a massive energy bullet. You can change the diffusion range. It depends on how long you hold the B button. Oh, fun. Being reminded, ha trying to do more cleaning as I'm gonna start packing tomorrow. And nice. Yeah, it's it's still kind of surreal. Like the fact that we're actually getting a better place. <laughs> like, yeah, congratulations on that. Oh, a nice place. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Bye. laughs> um. Yeah, especially, I mean, you know, totally wanted to get out of here sooner, but, you know, a lot of life started happening, as well as world events, like a global pandemic that also, like, threw a monkey wrench into things. Yeah, no, that that was a monkey wrench into almost everything. Yeah. I mean, the only, the only thing beneficial out of it was the success of uh, Among Us. <laughs> and then, um... Before that had happened, there was also, you know, I, I lost a job. Ah, uh, thank you. Yeah, like I was out of work for a few months, and a lot of that also kind of went happened because of like 
So it was like I lost a job, and then you know I started interviewing for stuff. Then got offered, then got a, uh, got offered the job that I have now. The thing that stunk though was this happened right in November, and the company they were like, hey, they're extending an offer, they want to hire you, and I was like, great. The problem was though they just got put into a hiring freeze. Oh. So, it was the thing of like, they want to send an offer, but you can't start until after New Year's. And I was like, well, I, 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 was, I'm, I really hate that word on a personal level. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I could go into personal detail, but I don't want to make this too much about me. Nah, yeah, it, yeah, it, you know, like it stunk, but. You know, thankfully, you know, I had I had support from family that helped us through bills through the holidays and then uh yeah, and you know had to rebuild savings and all that good shit. So But you know, we're we're much we're in a much better place now, thankfully. So. Good. Yeah. Hey, you know, also, like, because the other crazy thing with the pandemic was, man, that was a very good time to sell old video games. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Good time no, to sell I, new video games, too. Or consoles, at least. For, well, yeah, but there was also this whole thing, like, you have, like, you have these kids that grow up on, like, PS2 stuff, and they're in their 20s now. And they they had disposable income of like you know I want the the childhood games I had, and I had a lot of stuff to sell. Um, and people got free time to buy from you. Yeah. Um, and I and I mean you know I had to use some of that towards some bills and stuff, but man, it was <laughs> it's also going to make moving a lot easier because I don't have whole libraries of stuff I have to move. <laughs> I know that feeling. Ain't that nice? Ugh. Yeah. I... I mean, and it was also the... It, it was also the decision I kind of came to, like, in the long run, where... Like, when you, you know... Throughout my 20s and 30s, I was a collector. And... When you reach 40... You really stop and take stock of like, okay, how much of this do I really want to hold on to and how much does it mean to me really? And there was a lot of stuff to where I was like, I'm never going to touch this again. This can go. This can go. This can go. This is worth triple digits. Oh, that can go. Um, and then you, like, you move past that and then you get to the really hard stuff. Like stuff that I've played through multiple times and I have really good memories with and I'm like do I really want to sell it and and then when I thought about it and I was like okay I love this game but if I'm honest with myself it was the last time I played it and the answer was oh god I haven't touched this since I finished it and it was just the kind of thing of like well shit Oh, this is yeah, you're, 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 shit, you are neck deep in it. Oh god, oh god. I gotta say distant. You can do it. Fuck. Yeah, this is this seems to be where the game really puts the screws to you. Shit. Damn it. Did I just hear Ellie say deep throating? Ouch. Deep. I, look I, 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 I I think she said the word useless. Uh she's she's still playing some stuff. <laughs> okay, good. Ouch. Oh, now I know exactly what she's doing. She's she's fishing in Final Fantasy XIV. Ah. <laughs> uh, 
Isn't that another Which... term for grinding or farming? No, she is. Oh. So there is a literal, there is a little, there is a literal fishing mechanic in the game. Oh. Where you know you get your fish a pole and you go to a body of water and you wait until RNG says you can get a fish. And <laughs> Fishy. Yeah, it's the it's the thing of like, like, <laughs> yeah, like it's a fishy mini game, just like any other fishing mini game you have played in anything. To where you know you cast your you choose bait, cast your line, you sit there, and then the thing says, oh, you got a bite, and then you push the button to to reel it in. Um, the thing in like an MMO like Final Fantasy fourteen is it is it is random what type of fish you are getting so mm. the pain in the ass comes from you are trying to get a specific type of fish and it's like okay they show up in this body of water go there but it's it's like it's like Pokemon catch rates to where it's like okay you've got you've got this much of a chance of this this one spawning and this Spot like. Oh, I get that. <laughs> yeah. It's fun. Hey, story progress. Yep. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, it's her again. Oh, shit. Ada, what can I do with that shield? If you can guard against the enemy slamming in, you might be able to nullify the enemy shield. So, an ordinary guard cannot be used. If you have some sort of catalyst, you can improve Jehuti's abilities. A catalyst? Please search for something like a board as a guard. All right. Oh, that's right. Tomorrow, or everybody's getting drunk. Grab that. Let's do it. Oh yeah, St. Patty's Day. Oh God, yeah, I, she's saying that again. I, I I saw I saw some people that were out with like, you know, they were wearing green and they had like the. I saw I saw at least one person wearing like a green bowler hat and stuff like that as they were. As they were walking out with like a case of stuff from like the liquor store that's nearby, so hmm. Shit. Please guard from there slamming in as you grab the surface of the perimeter wall. Otherwise, there's no chance you will survive. Ouch. Ah! Damage level exceeding 50%. Damn it! Exceeding 75%. The perimeter wall looks useful to guard with. Press the B button when you're at a section that looks easy to peel off. Guard with <laughs> Alright. Ouch. Shit. Yeah, thinking of this character, if I remember correctly, it's like she's an AI in this game because Damn it. her her character died in the first one. Hmm. Damn it! Shit, shit. Nope! Grab! What's the button for grab? Hang on. Uh, I think you have to make sure you're... You don't have a sub-weapon equipped. Okay. Gr 
No, Solar, I'm aware of that. It's just, I was... There we go. There we go. Grab a piece, grab a piece, come on. You're doing it. Come on. Wherever you are. Alright. I think I'm going to head off. I hope y'all have a good one. Yeah, I was going to stick around until you beat this boss, and then... Well, I've already knocked it down halfway. This is only the beginning of you coming? Ouch. Ouchie. Wow, way to knock out a couple of things. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Alright. Night, guys. I might actually no, follow some night, too. Oh, God! Now what do I have to do? Oh, man. There's nothing to grab now. Oh! Looks like you make her run into the like the like electrical field there. So you gotta you gotta bullfight her ass like. Oh, somebody uh, sent a donation. Oh. Hey. All right. God damn it! Yeah, you gotta let you gotta let her run into that force field. I know that's what I'm trying to do. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Fuck you. Yeah. I don't know. I currently don't have, um... Actually, I should be able to see if we... No? Oh, man. We obtained the device driver for the sub-weapon Comet. This is a weapon with great enemy homing capabilities. I th it was... I think it was my when Kofi, I was but Barum, I... I didn't receive any, um... The enemy is a battle AI that will never stop following a target while the target continues to exist. If it's modeled after Viola, it's so much the worse. Ada, is this the settlement? There are life signs in many buildings. We have come to the worst place. Let's leave. Hey, Henry G! Have you already arrived on Mars? Who is this? It's Taper. We met on Deimos. Are you still alive? That's a miracle, isn't it? <laughs> I transmission from the eight heads wow, what a dickhead. I know! <laughs> He's such an asshole. Yeah. I love him for it. They seem to be stuck and confined in a facility by a cliff. I'm going to the point of origin of the dispatch now. I'll be there soon. Hey, by the way, what is your mission? What's going on there? Maybe they don't into you. I probably didn't update it. Man, see, seeing the camera zoom in on like the model of that mech, it's like, yeah, that is that is some PS2 ass geometry <laughs> on this model. On that, like, uh. oh wow, he's actually doing something. I know, right? All teams, move in 
formation too. Meet again. He must have grown a pair. Exterminated. Stand by, stand by. Hey, Taper, they seem like your pals, don't they? Why didn't you say our pals? Don't you know them? Ada, put me through to that unit. This is Storm Company. What are you doing? Do you want to involve civilians? Who cares? Anyhow, they're only the small fry of Vasilia. Hey, what? He must be really upset. Henry G, please help them. Damn. Taper, there's no guarantee, though. Please. Storm Company, I'm coming to help. Who is this? Don't talk too much. What's Ada? with his lips? Which are you going to help? The Space Force or civilian buildings? Both. All right. The damage percentage... I think it's the the unfortunate thing of... No. Uh, African Americans in anime, like... <sighs> Uh, I'm not even gonna say the actual word. I think that's poor taste. Yeah. What do I do when I want a lev to stop attacking the building? You will employ the sub weapon geyser. Sure, I can stop them moving with geyser. Ada, you're good at your job for a battle AI. My previous runner influenced me greatly. That must be that Leo I met. He always had respect for human life. <laughs> you're the type that behaves the way the man you love wants you to. I do not <laughs> comprehend. You don't have to. It will all end when I dispose of Barom's unmanned machine. Anyway, let's go. Certainly. Mission start. All right. Well. Let's eliminate uh, enemy. That. <laughs> Is the game so, saved? I'm gonna have. Yeah. Let me go ahead. Gotta save you save. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just save here. There we go.